Welcome back guys to Hyrule Warriors where now I'm in a fight versus Agatha to get a key to get out of these doors with Zant escaping currently. I don't know if I'm going to be able to stop him in time. We need Agatha to attack me and do whatever she can do to enable me's weakness strikes to get an EQ you. You're so mean. But if Zant stays there for a time, I might be able to win this. Otherwise, it's going to be very hard. Right then, where's Agatha gone? Right then, Agatha, attack me any way you want to. See what happens when you get in my way? Go, Wizro, go! Allied base is in trouble as well. Why? There shouldn't be anyone there. Okay, curses the base won't last against that thing's fireballs. What, the Argorok? Quickly defeat Argorok as well? Hi, someone help me! I seem to have gotten greedy and ended up with the worst situation. Either we engaged... Okay, Zant has resumed advancing as well. Probably because Wizrow's out. Curses, I didn't anticipate it'd be this far hard. Oh, Wizrow's fled as well. He's going to escape at this rate. I can't take Agatha down in time. Volga has captured the King's Hall. Sure, I'm guessing that's great. Does that stop advancing to fight dark forces once again? I need him to stop even more and I need my base not to go down in the meantime. Attack me! Will this be enough to finally take Agatha out? Right, we've got ourselves the key. The door is open, yes? Okay, the door is open. Can we make it in time? The main base is in peril. Upper level east is about to fall. All I can do is take on Zan. Now get the beat before he escapes. Well, it's easier said than done, isn't it? I would quickly intercept Zan, but things are going on apart from that. Right, I have to take out Zan right now, otherwise it's all over. I'm impressed and I'm not easily impressed, but Argorok's going to take my base. Unless I can take Zant. Right, Zant's been hit for a fair whack of damage, but still not enough. This is the ridiculous race now we've got to go through. To win this one. Oh, my HP's dropped to nothing as well. Not what I was intending. The morale of the forces nearby means that singular hits are just well too overpowering. Right, where's Zant? I don't need you, mate. I need Zant. Do as much damage as I possibly can to him. But every slash he does is just overpowering as well. I need more help. This Delphos Chieftain. Right, this Red Dead Knight going down will help even the field a little bit more. Ah! Right, another captain going down is not a bad thing. Where's Zant? Zant, fight me! Right, he's so low. Can I do this in time? Chip damage is the best option for me. Well, I can't be hit by him like that, that's for sure. I'm trying my hardest here and you probably see like I've got into... On the verge of falling allied base. The base is crumbling on loose fireballs, I know! That's why I'm wailing on Zant ridiculously! Defeat Argrok immediately? Well, defeat Zant was our victory condition. Oh, you unhand me, peasant. Oh. Come now, Zant. Serve me and I'll let you live. I'll even leave your palace standing. What do you say? I say that what we just did was one of the hardest missions so far. Feather resistance would seem futile. Fine, I'll submit quietly. <laughs> Good boy, never forget, you work for me now. 
Victory is achieved, but how much HP was my base on? That's what I'm left to wonder. I feel like I hard moded that encounter, not only just because it's on hard mode, but the way that I went about doing it for funsies proved me really hard! Oh my goodness, well that was a battle and a half, wasn't it? A Dragonbone Pike obtained, a Knight's Sword for Link, Cursed Shackles for Midna, Scepter of Time for Seer, and a Dragonbone Pike hits well, another one. On top of that, Zant's Magic Gem has been claimed, so is Midna's hair, and Agfa's basket. We've also got Darknet Armor, Three Dead Bandages, Monster Teeth, and Metal Plates. Most importantly, we won! Just. So with that said, we return well to the timeline split, but this time over to Skyloft where our playable warriors encounter amongst the many, still the three of them. So we'll find out exactly what that's going on after we check to see if there's any more badges that I can equip, any more powering up of my characters can be done. So I'll see you in a second! And so, with more badges done for the Forces of Light, but not so much for Seer, Volga, and Wizro, we continue onwards with this tale for the fourth adventure. This time we're heading to Skyloft. I've leveled up our evil trio to level 13. They were level 11, so it's only a slight gain, because I've got rupees to spare, so why not? And as we go onwards, I think we'll be using Seer once again, seeing we've used all of them. Volga was probably the most fun gameplay so far. Let's go back to she who it tells it's about. So with the scepter, strength free, four star, let's get down there and see what's gonna happen next. Sia sensed another powerful and unknown entity in a separate rift in time, this one on the floating island of Skyloft. When she arrived there, she found it already beset by a vast army of monsters. But who commanded them, Sia wondered. The inhabitants of Skyloft were clearly overwhelmed. Many thought that the end of the world was at hand. Phi, a servant of the goddess, fought alongside the humans, but the beasts' advance could not be stopped. A great darkness would soon overtake Skyloft. Though Sia cared nothing for the fate of the villagers, she began formulating a plan. Whatever being had brought these creatures to Skyloft would make a powerful servant. She would need to subjugate it and make it her own. Launching herself into battle to defend Skyloft, Sia looked for an opportunity to weaken this dark power and then add it to her forces. So after securing Zant, it seems we're after even more generals to add to our army. So, Gilihim is our opponent, Sia, Volga, and Wizro go with no added captains. Gilihim's forces have the Imprisoned, along with a billion Stalmasters. I'm not so sure about that. The Imprisoned, a big boss type character, and Fi and Skyloft captains are around, though, by the look of it, they probably won't be around for long, considering the Imprisoned has made the Skyloft somehow. But still, let's start the battle and find out how this unfolds. Obviously, we're gonna have to defeat both forces. Lots of multi-force battles going on in this whole event tale. So, the demon is nothing special, but this giant beast may prove too great a challenge even for us. Don't sound so depressive. Oh, we're not going to fight it head on, there's a brain. We'll something out with some locals first. Obviously what we're going to do. Right then, capture Central Square or South Rockface Keep. Either one. Well, the other one has a captain in it. But this one we're right close to, so we can probably take that in about two seconds time. We'll take the materials first. First we need to win the trust of these people. Go take back one of their keeps for starters. Okay then. We're going for diplomacy. We're going to try and work with Fi or something like that. Add more to our troops that way so we can battle Gili him and all that. Well, there we go. I've taken out a fair amount of them. Oh, Volga, that is brilliant. Volga, you're a keep buster, you are. That's for sure. Well, I'll take these extra rupees at the moment. Send more Dark Links on their way. Chop through those troops, will you? 
Right, Keep Boss has already appeared. Volga seems to be nuking it. I should have left these guys to it, took the other base. Right, we have captured Central Square. Nicely done, nicely done. Central Square is open. So let's see what's going on. Well, the Spellmaster appears first of all. Now, I'm not hanging around for that one, but I will get the weakness strike in. And with just one little H. Oh! I was expecting to whip you and defeat you, but ah! You just got in there in time. Another weapon acquired, though, so we continue onwards. Captain's defeated. His paths are here. Dark Falsers have made contact with Skyloft forces. Someone's fleeing. Someone's in danger and then fleeing. Well, it can't be one of my forces, surely. <laughs> Thank you. We'll take all the help we can get. We've joined up with Fi. Like, properly? Okay, then. Allies we will be. I'm not so sure about that. I must recommend you prioritize the defeat of the demon and the imprisoned above all other tasks. Well, I imagine the defeat of the imprisoned is the biggest task. Indeed it is. So, that said, we've gained control of the fee's resting place. Don't let five flee is our defeat thing. So, okay, then. Who dares interfere in the works of Lord Gillyhim? I must punish you most deliciously. Oh, really? Well, I don't care. I'm going to go fight the imprisoned now that we've taken out these captains up here. Oh, well, maybe I do care now that I've seen what exactly what you're planning to do. The small one is controlling the big one. If he takes our base, we lose, so put your backs into it. Are you saying destroy thingy then? We've rescued a guy in the meantime. Oh, weak, 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 weak. Get there, Sam. Oh, you knocked him down with a special, took out his legs and everything, and then kind of ruined it. So the weakness strike there, enabling me to get rid of another captain. Maybe it's time for me to head to defeat Gilly him instead. Well, I'm breaking these toes as much as I can. Indeed, I have. Fi's probability of survival is dropping rapidly. Well, so is mine with all these steps. Only two toes to go here. Getting him is making it past my forces. Not what I want to see. I need to go back. Right, well, we've taken you down to this point, have we? But not so easy to take you out from this point, eh? Right, I need to run. Because he's going to be my main base. And if he's controlling it all, then... I just have to leave Fi to it and hope she can do it. Whoever was defending here, however, you suck. Because you just let him walk past after engaging him for two seconds, Volga. Right then, Wizrose engaged in a few captains, but that's not honest. Oh, do you want to call this hold me at your base? I will destroy this eyesore and dance magnificently on its remains. I, I think you won't. Maybe I should have took this one first. Oh, fi. Not the time. So I've got to rescue fi. I don't even know why I'm blowing this up. Money is good, I guess. But still... Rescue Fi and rescue my base. It seems Volga's actually going back to intercept Gilihim. But I guess the most important thing to do is to save Fi, considering she's a defeat objective as well. And she's just getting hurt all over the place by being nearly imprisoned. Bust those toes down again. It is unlikely that I would decide to flee from battle. That's good to hear after you've already kind of set yourself to flee from battle. Right, they're going for each other then. And first of all, the imprisoned is just wrecking my face. Well, fire's full HP now, so you're getting left behind. Enjoy your time over there. In the meantime, I need to pick up a red thing and 
then defeat Giddy him because it seems the Imprison is a little bit too hard to take down HP wise. Getting his weakness gauge down wasn't really going my way, was it? Right, Red Jar. Thank you for being one. Giddy him, I come at you with force. Wizro, if you can take that keep, that would be amazing. But until then, it's just I need to fight Gillyheem. Defeat the Imprisoned is not going to happen. Fine needs to take that on her own. Right, so we've got two captains in here. Volga's doing fine, it seems. Okay, no Stonemasters then. Oh, he says as a Stonemaster appears and Gillyheem decides to get a good whack away on me. Not what I wanted to see. I want to take out the Style Master so I have one less target to think about. And then I could just deal with Gillyheem. Especially if you let me get a weakness strike on you just like that. Right then, so... The fire resurrected. She should last a little bit longer in this battle, that's for sure. Well, more magic, you say? Magic full, in fact. Where have you gone? Okay, there you are. Well, we could use magic to knock you down, but to be honest, I don't think defeating you will get rid of the imprisoned entirely, so what we're gonna do is not be an idiot about things and save that magic for when we need it, because we can break down Gillyhim the normal way. You're going to cast a spell, are you, sir? You tend to be slightly easier for me to take down weak strike-wise anyway. I can chip you down nicely as well. Somebody said a support, you say? Well, first of all, I'll take out who's controlling the beast. Right. It's a presence inside the sorceress. Could it be? No. Impossible. Gary him is temporarily retreated, which is definitely what we needed at the time. So with all our stuff filled up, it's time to defeat the Imprisoned, now that we haven't got so much hassle going on. Right, well first of all, considering Wizro's already done some work here, take ourselves a base is never a bad option, especially when he's already getting juggled. In the first place, I'll keep Ross. There we go, get defeated, give me my materials. Well, let's get pressing onwards, another keep has been taken. Well, I wonder if I can take it if I go down for another keep. Let's just check her HP quickly, if you know what I mean. Fi's HP is nicely fine. We might lose another captain, but considering the fact that we're the forces of evil, if another Skyloft captain goes down, I'm not sure it's that much of a bad thing for us. So flee you may. I don't really care. In terms of fulfilling my goals, it's probably best to let you go. And for Fi to be as low HP as possible when it comes to what I'd consider to be an inevitable battle. So another keep will be ours. Right, 400k is so far, not exactly that extravagantly high. We are doing damage, let's put it that way. West Town Keep won't have much longer in it. And that brings us one step closer to base. Or with more to the point, to imprisoned. Alright, Stalmaster Master in my path here. Easy guess, let's get beaten you. Big red marker on him after all the map. Had to be. And we're powerful enough to nuke him down just like that. Even though level 13 upgrade only actually really gave us the tiniest attack upgrade, I think it's more this weapon. But with a little bit of smithying, it was made nicely better. I'll take these rupees, it's no problem. Whoa, look, 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 look! Okay, was not expecting the Imprisoned to suddenly chase me and start to try to eat me. No wonder Fi's fine, the Imprisoned isn't even bothering with her. 
but it seems there's another style master all the way back here. Randomly enough. If you can call it random. He's, ow, your backslashes are really good, sir. I guess I'll have to chip damage you down if you're not going to perform any attacks, sir. There we go. Let's finish this. The Imprison's gone back to chasing Fi down. And we've made sure this base remains ours for now. Right then, so the Imprison's still fighting Fi. We continue onwards next episode to defeat it and see what else happens. Because, of course, I'm pretty sure Gilihim has realised what exactly lies inside. So, we'll see you next time for more Hyrule Warriors. Bye-bye.